we, modern human beings, scientists, technologists, economists, sociologists, speak about what science can do, what technology can do, and so on and so forth. Sometimes people say, oh, this is a problem that uh, technology has brought to us. I think that this thought is mistaken. Technology does nothing, sociology does nothing, science does nothing. It's human beings that do things. What do we do with our knowledge? What do we do with the claims that we make about adequate actions that we can perform? This is the point. I claim that the history of humanity is the history of the science. It's not the history of natural resources, it's not the history of material opportunities, it's not the history of, of the material world that is there. It's the history of the science. Something is resourced if I want it. If I don't want it, it's not a resource. Something is something that I need to the extent that I want it. I claim that we always do what we want. Even when we claim that we are doing something that we don't want. Because when I do something that I claim I don't want to do, but I do it anyhow, it means that I want the consequences of my doing that which I claim I don't want to do. So I do whatever. History of humanity is the history of science. Our problem is that to the extent that we claim that things take place with independence from us, we are not aware that what we do arises from other science. That it's not science, it's the scientists. It's not technology, it's the technologists. We do things. Responsibility takes place in the moment in which you are aware of the consequences of your actions. You can look at them, you can reflect upon them, and then you act according to whether you like or you don't like those consequences. This is where responsibility is. Whenever somebody does something and says, no, well, no, what's happening imposed upon me is not taking responsibility. And freedom arises in the responsibility of responsibility. In the moment in which you are aware of doing something because you want it, you put it there for yourself to contemplate in the domain of your desires. Do I want what I want? In that moment you are free. And I shall then make a reference to an old Argentinian standard. I'm not going to sing, you may be tranquil, I'm only going to to recite a few lines. I call it the tango of responsibility. It says, Arrest me, officer. I am a criminal. The proofs of my infamy I carry in my suitcase. The tresses of my beloved and the heart of the traitor. This is a respectable person. Takes responsibility on what he or she does. Thank you.